Terry Carter here, and I wanted to do this video about shit and honey. <laughs> it was actually the same. My wife told me years and years ago. Matter of fact, we were just dating at the time. She said it was something her dad told her, and it was life is a barrel of shit and honey. <laughs> Sometimes you get all the shit at one time. Sometimes you get all the honey at one time, and sometimes it's just mixed all up. So I wanted to do this because we've been going through some shit lately. <laughs> and I, I tell my wife, we just, you know, today today was the worst day. Tomorrow's going to be better. Now, it's been a it's been a interesting thing because business, business has been good. Just been going through some stuff personally. And so... Uh, a couple months ago, I started having real bad sciatica pains, like real bad, like debilitating, <laughs> crawl, crawl on the floor sometimes when it was so stiff and tight and pain, shooting pain down my leg to my feet, burning, and it was uh, very, very painful. I couldn't sleep. I mean, I was, if I slept at all, I was sleeping like short an hour or so at a time, and then I was up and couldn't find a position in bed to sleep, and it just was a really bad pain. Went to the doctor, did all these things, watching YouTube videos on stretching and things to do, and it was just a real, real bad pain and discomfort I was going through. Then I went to a conference in Florida, and I came back and had COVID. <laughs> so I had COVID. I was vaccinated, and um, when I got COVID, they actually – gave me some special antibodies because I only have one kidney and they were worried about that. And so then I quarantined myself for 10 days in my room. My wife brought me food, um, didn't see my kids, um, you know, so we actually followed the rules of quarantine. And it was funny because actually the COVID wasn't so bad and thankfully I didn't give it to any of my workers here at the shop. I didn't give it to my wife or kids. So that was a blessing. And actually the sciatica that I just mentioned was actually more painful than the COVID. The COVID was, was really minimal for me, but the sciatica was still, still bad. So then after I got out of quarantine, got back to work, I read a great book called Healing the Back, which was recommended by a friend of mine. And it was just talking about how pain like sciatica pain, back pain, um, shoulder pain, pain in your butt, um, it's usually caused by some kind of mental repression uh, that you've, been, you've had maybe as a kid or, or recently or stress, um, not enough oxygen to that part of the body. Which, So it's, it's a manifestation, the pain from something that's going on psychologically. So that was a really good book. And even though today I still have some soreness here and there throughout the day, I'm actually walking and I got to surf today. Uh, I'm back to lifting again, back to my workout routine. So then we get a call about a week ago or an email from the kids' school saying their teacher and some of the kids in their class have COVID and that kindergarten is shut down. <laughs> so uh, they go get tested. My wife and, and twins both get tested and my wife and son come back positive my my daughter didn't although i think she is just because they didn't really get a very good sample so i mean it, it ain't that a, a a blast i guess that i have covid we quarantine try to be really safe so the kids and my wife don't get covid and then just a random thing at school they get covid so my wife's been hit a little bit harder than I was with the COVID. My son's fine. My daughter's fine. I mean, just rocking and rolling uh, at home in quarantine. So it's just one of those things like, oh my gosh, we've been going through a lot of shit lately. <laughs> we're going through a lot of shit. Um, we had some, some IRS stuff that we were dealing with as well and some sales tax stuff too. So it was just like a lot of stuff going on. But a couple of things. One, shit and honey. So there's always honey. There's always shit. And we've been going through a lot of shit lately. And we so say you got to stay, stay focused and stay positive. Every day is a new day. Keep grinding. Don't stop. Know that that honey is going to come 
maybe all at once, maybe mixed in a little bit. So, uh, but anyway, that's life, right? That's life. It happens to all of us. And all we can do is put our head down, keep grinding, keep pushing, and uh, things will get better. So, hey, right, there you go. Life is full of shit and honey. <laughs>